guys, it's Linthor. Welcome back to another video on my channel. If you're not already subscribed, don't forget to. And I, I know you guys are annoyed, but you know, some people forget. <laughs> I'm so excited for today's video. Not only is it sponsored, but it's like, I haven't done an outfit video in such a long time. And this isn't really an outfit, but this is definitely a try on kind of haul video. You guys have been requesting outfit videos, which makes me so happy that you guys like actually you like my clothing style. Like a thousand rivers of crying. I, I love you guys. Thank you for showing appreciation. Today's video is sponsored by Uvimi. Uvimi, Uvimi, Uvimi. Jesus, this is something I should have. Uh... Uvimi. You guys know there's like some stores circling around on Instagram that has this Harajuku kawaii style, and I have to say one of them is awful. Awful and it's really famous. I don't want to talk about it right now because this video is not about that So out of those that exist that are really famous I think there would be three and one of them sucks This one is by far the best quality because I've gotten from every one of them I have quite a selection here. This is my first outfit So I thought I'd just start with that. So obviously this is a bit of a ruffle shirt this comes as a two-piece. You can separate them and wear whatever you want under the little short dress, or you can just use the ruffle top for whatever you want to. You have a bit of stretch on the arms, so you can have it down or you can have it up, whatever you choose. The shirt is also unbuttonable, so you can use it open, closed, you can choose how much you want to open. It's all up to you. Out of these two pieces, the shirt quality is my favorite one. It's a little, little, little bit stretchy, but it's still a nice material. It doesn't itch and it feels good. Also, the seaming is good. So as usual, I want you guys to just see close-ups on the clothing so you can get your own opinion of the quality. I'm gonna try and show you the best I can on camera because, uh, you know, my explaining capabilities are like zero. Not only am I Swedish, but I suck at even explaining in Swedish stuff. So for me to do it in English is even worse. I don't even know what this material is called. It's thick. You can feel that it's gonna hold. It's, it's not like Forever 21 where everything just breaks. And I paired it with my Kuma beer ears from Mid Cafe in uh, Akihabara and my brow wig and some dope makeup. Like, I love this look. I am obsessed. Let's move on to the next outfit. I don't know why, but this is like my favorite one of all the items. It comes as a two-piece and it has a shirt in a kind of brown beige color and then the dress in a true brown, a really poo brown color. <laughs> I posted a picture on Instagram. You guys told me it looked like a hobo. No, I did not. I did not. This is so cute. Like this is legit and it's very slimming actually, in my opinion. It has the perfect length to just cover up everything if you don't feel like having a tight outfit or just looking like a, a garbage bag this is like gonna just make you look cute it still is very long so it gives a little bit of a ruffle and you can also open it up completely the bottoms bottoms buttons work and they're actually really good buttons they're not like gonna fall off i can actually like pull this so that's good the fabric looks like Manchester, is that what it's called? It's not real, it's much softer than that. It's more flowy. And it also has two usable pockets, which is a big plus. And then this little cute bear. And it's actually okay on the other side. It's not a disaster. Like other brands have given me. Should I spill the tea? I don't know, not right now maybe. And then the shirt is kind of in this it's not as soft, it's a little bit harsh, but still not something that would itch. And then you can also button this down in the back. And this is how the seaming looks like. It's actually really good. I did not expect things to be as good as they arrived. Okay, next up, let's do the pants, cause these are something I'm gonna wear to some of the outfits, cause I got a lot of shirts. These ones, I, I, if I remember correctly, they were supposed to be long pants, but on me, it looks like children pants. I actually do like them. I have been using them outside. Like this is the only thing I've actually went out in because they fit so well. This is the first time I've gotten a pair of jeans or pants online. Like this is the first time because nothing ever fits me. But since it's stretchy here, it makes my butt look really good. And also it's a little bit poofy around 
the pockets and then it's tied around the legs, which I feel slims down my legs a lot. So I actually like these pants a real lot. And also they have small cute dogs with a pink bow and they actually look good. They're sewn on really well. They don't look ratchet at all. Not even one seam is wrong. It does have fake pockets. It's not like a pair of expensive jeans, but they're really like, they really form after my body. Okay, next up is my least favorite item. It's this cardigan, knit cardigan. Something I've learned is that knit is really hard to buy. Not a really breathable material. It's polyester and that's something I don't, I keep away from polyester as much as possible, which I know is really, if you want to do that, you kind of have to change it out for cashmere and stuff like that, it's really expensive. Nonetheless, it's very cute. When I saw it on the website, I loved it. It has these stars and also some bronze circles. What a bad wording. It's like pins. It is really cute and it's gonna be great for photos, but for me, it's just not gonna be good for everyday wear. So why not continue with the knit? This is actually in way better material than the last one. This feels like more soft and it's way more stretchy. And also the clouds, they're really well sewn on. These are like some details that you might notice when you buy from websites that have kawaii, harajuku, cute style, that things are just really sloppy done. And it's, I don't like that, but these are really good. You can also see on the back that there's like, it looks really clean, even when it's on the back side, like a Mac that we like. Also, the collar is really well done and I think it fits me very nice and it's super, super cute. This is something I could wear definitely. Not right now, because it's fucking boiling outside. I'm dripping in sweat right now. Next! Okay, so this is one of my favorite items that I received. This is the back and it's this really cute anime girl. I love this shirt so much. This is just something that is gonna be so cute with high-waisted jeans. Like whatever jeans you wanna wear, you can wear it with this shirt and it's gonna look really edgy, I think. And kawaii at the same time. This is how she looks up close. This might get really sweaty, so maybe it's not for summer. It's thundering. Thunder! Thunder! Oh, whoa, whoa, oh, whoa! What? It's, th it's thunder. I'm like, wow, yeah. Love you. We love, we stand, fam. Also, the sewing is very good. Everything is really well sewn, and I love that. Love, love, love. The printing is a little tad patchy, but nothing really noticeable. I think it looks really good. Now for the last shirt that I got is this one. And actually I thought this one looked way better on the website. It's, it's a bit, the material is not something I'm a big fan of. It's a little bit harsh. I want my t-shirts to be really soft, like the red one. The red one is perfect. This is a little bit too harsh, but nonetheless, it looks really good. It's like this cute, I think it reminds me of like a school shirt, a bit of a nerdy school shirt. This is how the sewing looks like. Yeah, it's, it's a cute shirt. And I think it's very breathable. So this is probably a better summer shirt than the other one. Let's move on. This beret, oh my God, how cute is this? Fish in Japanese is sakana. I just learned that, so yeah. Throwing it out there. They are really cute. They're like poking out of the beret. I love the material. It feels like it's wool. Love my wool. It looks good inside as well. It's not like falling out. It's actually good. And if something, if you want to buy anything from these kinds of sites, it's 100% sure that if you get an accessory, like a hat or a wig or maybe a keychain or something, it's going to look poppin'. Because every time I've ordered something and I've ordered out clothing from other side, they've come back, looked ratchet, but I could still use the accessories. So I'm pretty sure that goes for you, Vimi, as well, because this beret is awesome. I love this beret. This looks so intricate. Like, wow, wow. Now for the last item I got, it's this, it's this rose patterned, almost like a nightgown. This is me going into my romantic period where I really love things that just look like romantic. It's a bit darker than the website showed it to be, so it's a bit more pink, but it's got some nice details. I didn't even notice. It had some lacing 
on the sides of like the skirt. So you have Liz here, but no Liz back, and then Liz here again. And then you have this Liz arms with a little bow on it. I found my white satin dress, and oh my god, this looked so good together. I loved how this looked. This look was one of my favorites, actually. And the sewing is really good on this one. You just have on one arm on the on the tool, whatever this is called. But overall, this is very nice. I like it. And it smells good. Oh my god. I'm dripping like seriously this summer has been insane. So that's everything I got from UV Me. But if you're interested in Harajuku kawaii cute style, don't forget to check out the links down below. I think I will have a discount code. If I do, it's gonna pop up here and it's gonna be in the description box. So go click that link. You will definitely be seeing me on the website, I hope, and on my Instagram with these outfits. I've taken some really dope pictures and they're gonna be up, so don't forget to follow me there either. I know a lot of you guys actually don't follow me on Instagram, so don't forget to do that. I think I post some pretty dope pictures right now. I've gone up with my Instagram again for sure, so don't forget to check out that. What do you think, Hannibal? Do you like my outfits? Yes, I really, really do. Oh, you do. I love you. You're the best. Wow. I loved this. Amazing. Au revoir, konnichiwa, sayonara. Peace out. I love you guys. Bye.